There has been some flooding lately in Marion County. We had about a week of rain. If you haven't been around, you have probably heard about it on the news. El Nino and La Nina had a little fight. So this is just south of Ocala on 475A. They are pumping the water out. This happens anytime we get significant rains out here. There's typically a little pond. It doesn't look anything like this. But you can see 475A goes right underneath the road there. And this road runs north and south, just south of Trinity Catholic High School. This is a big farm here. So they have one entrance. I can't remember a summer where this has not happened. However, I haven't ever seen it this bad before. This is pretty, pretty rough. And you can imagine they've already pumped some water out since it's uh, been a couple days since the rains have stopped. So this is what's left. The road is obviously still closed as it's underwater. I don't even know how these people get to their property uh, when it's like this. It's pretty interesting. The Ocala Drive-In has seen quite a bit of flooding as well. So we're going to take a look at that in just a minute. But I can tell you that this entire area has been pretty crazy with rain. I mean, it rained nonstop for an entire week. And I would say that on this road, you're probably looking at five to six foot of water deep. It's covering the whole road. Here's the Ocala Drive-In. Uh, this, you can see there's actually a line on the bottom of the white building there, just under the roof. That's where the water was. It was all the way up to the bottom line under their window. Now they are trying to reopen this as soon as they can. Uh, they're trying to pump the water out. They had a bulldozer in here, a tractor with a front end loader on it, uh, trying to move some dirt around as we were there. The water has come down significantly. It was all the way up to that building right in the middle of the parking lot there. That is where the restaurant is, where all the cars park. And you can see the wet sand. It's, it's receded quite a bit, but that, that area underneath the screen there, that's their arcade, and it is definitely <laughs> probably still inside there. You can see the guy with the tractor in the bottom right. Looking forward to this opening up because it is one of Ocala's main attractions, especially since COVID, where everybody realized it was actually available. Hope you enjoyed the video. Have a nice day, and I will see you in the next one.